Hello guys, today I will be redoing my video on how to install OpenMW. If you've seen my video from around 3 years ago, you'd realize that I am hot garbage and the video was 23 minutes long with about 15 minutes of unnecessary fluff, and then about 5 minutes of me babbling on like an idiot. That FC Land on YouTube made a far more concise video about this that actually helps the community, so shout out to him and I will link it down below. This guide is for Windows users and will be relatively short with timestamps in the description so that you can skip to the appropriate segments. If you want a video on how to install mods, that can be its own separate video. Without further ado, let's begin. The first step is to completely uninstall Morrowind, either through the Steam or GOG client, or wherever you have it installed through. This way we have a clean slate to install OpenMW on top of. Next we will go to the OpenMW site, and then we will click Downloads. And since this is a Windows guide, we will go to the Windows section and do download from GitHub. Scroll down here, this is the most recent release, uh, 0 0.45.0. This does get updated somewhat frequently, so this may be different by the time you watch the video. Scroll all the way down, looks like there was a bunch of improvements. We'll go down here, uh, you'll want to download either the Win64 or Win32. Uh, you should be on Win64, but if you're on Win32, good for you, I guess, but we'll download 64, and we'll save that, and we're going to click, or double click this and do run, hit yes, hit next, I agree, um, I'm going to, you can keep this here, I'm going to use a different path just because that is me, I do things weird, um, so I'm going to copy in my path. That's fine, and hit install, and give that a second. And, yep, you can leave that checked into finish. Now, when you go to settings, you can do run installation wizard. Click next, use existing installation. If this doesn't show up for you, then you can do manually do browse, and then if, you're def if you installed it through Steam, the default path is usually the one I'm copying right now. It could be different depending on if you had it through GOG or if you selected a different path when you actually uh, reinstalled Morrowind. So, but once you go here, it's going to be Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Morrowind. You want the data files of your directory, do Morrowind DSM, click Next, choose your language, click Next, keep these checked, click Next, click Finish. So that should be that. You can go to graphics here and change change your uh, your resolution settings, vertical sync, full screen, etc. Uh, go to data files. Make sure Blood Moon is under Tribunal. Sometimes that can break it if Blood Moon is over tribu per Tribunal. I don't know why. That's just how it is. And then you should be good to just hit play. So that should be it. You should be ready to play uh, Morrowind through OpenMW. I will probably redo more of these videos like installing mods, installing the TES3 MP multiplayer add-on, and updating OpenMW in the future when new releases come out. Uh, but for now, this should get you up and running with the base game of Morrowind and OpenMW. Please consider liking and subscribing for more kind of okay content, I guess. 